the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, Warner Haven. I'm Kennedy, and you're watching BDTV for Friday, March 19th, 2021. Coming up on today's show, Finding Where You Belong and the Zoo. This month is Women's History Month, and during this month, it's important to remember the strong women who fought for equality. Marie Curie was one of the first women ever to receive a Nobel Prize, and the first person ever to get two. Curry was an inventor, most known for discovering two new elements and for researching the atom. I'm Paige. And I'm Kennedy. Let's get into these announcements. The March 2021 Scholarship Bulletin is out. Scholarships are for seniors unless specified. If they are specified, they are due to Ms. Heine at 1.15 p.m. At the end of the day, they are due. Students, please be sure to check your emails daily and for testing information from your teachers. Students, be sure to follow dress code. This includes pajama pants as they are not allowed on campus. No outside food is allowed to be delivered on campus, including your parents bringing you food during the day. Counselors have visited all English classes to explain the process of choosing electives for next year. There are still students who need to do this. To access the course list on Schoology, go to Groups, then select My Group, and paste in the access code, which is QQ4JBNB4TTSZF. Seniors, plan your finalize all your community service hours by Friday, April 16th, 2021. This deadline is for seniors wanting to have their community service awards at graduation. Seniors earning 250 plus service hours wear a silver cord and those earning over 1,000 receive an exceeding expectations medallion. All community service forms are on the website. See Ms. Farthing after school on Wednesdays in the cafeteria counseling office if you have any questions. And Kennedy, that's where some people feel like they belong. Here at Winter Haven, we have plenty of clubs and sports. No matter what you're interested in, I guarantee you Winter Haven will have something for you. I'm Izzy with BDTV. Let's go take a look. This must be band. Here at our school, our band is called the Pride of Winter Haven. Maybe I should give it a shot. Mmm, <laughs> I better not. Pajamas? Oh wait. These are scrubs, so that must mean we're in the medical academy. Ugh. Yeah, I just don't think I'm cut out for this. <gasps> so I guess this is football. Our team works really hard on season and off season to be the best they can be. I just really don't think contact sports are for me. So maybe sports aren't for me, but it's not too late for me to be the next Picasso. This is our art room. Our students here are so talented that their art even goes on to be displayed in the art show. Yeah, I should Vincent Van Gogh. Oh, I know where we are. This is Blue Devil Television, or more commonly known as BDTV. This is where our morning news show is produced and edited every single day. And more than just making the news show, we also compete in multiple competitions. This is where I fit in, and this is where my talents are best put to use. So just because one club doesn't work out, or multiple, doesn't mean you don't fit in anywhere. So don't give up, and find where you belong. Good morning, Winter Haven. I'm Izzy with BD. 
I wonder if Izzy's ever done track. I'm sure she has. Lady the Devils track and field had a great weekend at the Ridge Championship held at Frostproof. Senior Joy Perry was once again double champion, throwing a 10.66 meter to the shot put and 30.72 meter to the discus. She added the javelin this week and finished in second with a 20.88 meter. Junior Thomas Sue Borbor leapt 4.83 meters for the second place in the long jump. Freshman Jordan Fraser ran the third place in the 800 meter with a 2.42. Other scores were Kenya Jamerson fourth in the 400 meter, Bella Blind in fifth in the 3,200 meter, and seventh in the 1,600 meter. Jemiah Adams eighth in shot putt, and Jarianna Simpson, who was 8th in 800 meter. Congrats. Congratulations, you guys. And be sure to attend their next event at the Jenkins Classic at George Jenkins High School this Saturday, March 20th. You can find your obligations on Student Portal. If you have any overdue library books, those will be under the library tab. Contact Ms. Sia for any questions or to make payments. And if you have failed a class and need to retake it and are missing a class on your transcript or need to replace a class to improve that GPA, you're in luck. Winter Haven High School is offering credit recovery classes virtually through Ingenuity. Contact your guidance counselor or Mr. Parton in room 35106. Any senior that has filled a previous semester class and needs to make up the credit, there is a program taking place after school to help you out. It is Mondays through Thursdays from 2 to 3 in the Guidance Office Computer Lab. Visit a school counselor in the cafeteria during lunch to fill out a registration form. The classes are provided are English, Math, Science, and Social Studies. If you have any questions, call 863-291-5330. And congratulations to our Winter Haven JROTC Blue Devils Battalion. They took second place in the male-female mixed color guard competition at the Area 12 drill meet in Haines City. I wonder if JROTC has ever been to the zoo. Did you know that there are 41,415 species on the IUCN red list? 16,306 of those are on the verge of extinction, which is twice the amount of last year. I'm Nichols of BETV here at Lawyer Park Zoo. Let's go learn more about endangered species. Now you may be wondering, how does a species become endangered? Great question. A plant or animal is considered endangered after a major loss of population and or loss of habitat. One of the many endangered species here at Lawyer Park Zoo is the Bornean orangutan. This species of primates has roughly 45 to 69,000 left wild in the world. They feed mostly on fruit, but also insects, leaves, and bark. Florida is home to many different types of species. These include aquatic animals such as the Florida manatee, which is also on the IUCN red list. What a beautiful creature. The Florida panther is another endangered species locally from our state. It is estimated that there are only 120 to 130 panthers left in the wild. These animals are protected under federal law and harming them can lead to a charge of third degree felony. While it's extremely heartbreaking to see these animals diminish, there are many ways that we can help out, such as donating to organizations that protect these animals, such as the Wildlife Conservation Society, International Union for the Conservation of Nature, and the Defenders of Wildlife, and many more. This has been Nichols of BDTV, help preserve our wildlife. And I wonder if Nick will be trying out for cheer. Cheer tryouts will be from April 5th to 9th from 6 to 8 p.m. Registration starts at 5.30 p.m. each day. More information can be found on the Winter Haven Cheerleading Facebook page. Football signups for the 2021 season are beginning now. Sign up with Coach Tate. He will be in the football office before school and in his classroom after school to sign up. Afternoon workouts begin in April. Seniors, if you need a concordance score for the Algebra 1 EFC, the PER is offered the last Monday of every month. Please consider tutoring before taking the PER, as Algebra is a graduation requirement. Visit the links below to help prepare. And do you want to be a member of our award-winning BDTV staff? If you are a junior or a senior next year and have had Mrs. Mizell's class for at least one year, stop by room 36107 and get a BDTV application. BDTV is two class periods. One is dual and you will receive six college credits per year. And that is all for today, Winter Haven. I'm Paige with BDTV. Remember guys, spring break starts next week, the 22nd and ends the 26th. We will all come back the 29th. I'll see you then. I hope you have a great and safe spring break.